Hey, I told you in the meeting, but we got a special guest today, okay? Um, and I asked him to say a couple words to you guys. So just to give you some scope here, there's prop, no, it's not probably, that nobody has done more for Cal football than this guy. So Coach Tedford coached here for a long time. He's the winningest coach. It's the most successful tenure that there's ever been at Cal. Some of the best teams, all right, the ones that he coached. And as it relates to all of you and all of us, the reason this is all here and the facility win is here is because Coach Tedford's success and the vision he had. So ask him to say a couple words, so let's give it up for Coach Tedford. Yeah. Thank you. Uh, it's a privilege to be here and to see you guys. It's been a long time since I've been back because I've been coaching other places and things, but now I'm retired. And so I uh, wanted to make my first stop to come back here and kind of reminisce of all the good days here and uh, see what you guys are doing. I appreciate Justin and the staff allowing me to be here uh, to kind of get my football fix. And uh, I just want to let you guys know that uh, this is a special time in your life, right? Um, the relationships that you build right here together and what you guys, the hard work, dedication you guys put in with one another will last a lifetime. And the reason why I say that to you is 20 years ago when I became the coach here, Right? I look back now on how fast those 20 years went, but to see the bond that all those players have with one, had with one another and continue to have today, now that they have careers and, and families and all that kind of stuff, they continue to stay really, really close. So the bond that you guys are creating right now is really, really special. Right? There's nothing more exciting than what you guys are doing right now. So you're blessed to be here. This is a great university, as you probably know. It's an awesome university. It's awesome to be able to represent Cal and play the schedule you guys play in such a great facility. So it's a really special time in your life and what you guys just went through with all the COVID stuff. I hope you appreciate what you get to do, a little bit of normalcy, right? And so you can't take that for granted. But uh, it's a special time in your life, man. And there's a lot of people, I'm not just talking about you know, the Aaron Rodgers or the Marshawns, the Shawns, and all those people that I was fortunate to coach and privileged to coach. It's every kid that played out here and put in the hard work every single day to make each other better. That's important, right? So enjoy each other's company, enjoy it, man, because it's gonna, it's gonna come and it's gonna go really fast, right? And I want you to know that there's a tremendous amount of pride to coming through that tunnel, okay? And wearing that cow helmet. There's a lot of pride and there's a lot of people over the years. I can tell you, I was here, came here 20 years ago and I coached here for 11 years. But all the people even before that, that take so much pride in what you guys do and watching you guys on Saturdays. All right, a lot of people are watching, a lot of people are proud of you. All right, so continue the hard work. I know you got a couple weeks till game time. Preparation is key, right? Do your best to create habits. Habits only happen with uh, consistent repetition. And that's what you're doing out here right now is, is building good habits. So how you practice is how it's going to carry over into the game. All right, but I want you guys to know a lot of people are watching you. A lot of people are proud of what you're doing. And I wish you guys all the best. Okay, good luck. Thank you. Thank you.